welcome to Grace 10314. And then let's get on with the show. How you guys doing? We the Street Kings from New York. Uh, we are normally from Queens, Bronx, on the other side of the bridge, but um, you know, about four years ago we came together to talk about uh, philanthropy that will suit some of our own brother's needs in terms of uh, awareness to autism. We found the Grace Foundation, we reached out. Kathy has been super helpful in terms of keeping, you know, our tradition alive and coming here every year. Donations have fluctuated between $25 to $4,000 every time and we've seen the progress that they've done here at the facility so you know it's good to be able to see like where the money is being invested and how the students and children and families are benefiting from. I wonder, can I write it? Oh, let me think about it. If, 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 if. Probably like around January and February, we'll talk about the different designs and mock-up shirts. This is our this is our shirt for this year, um, and we sell them to the biker community, families, uh, maybe where we work. Um, each shirt's about twenty dollars, and whatever we sell, we, you know, is all donated to the Grace Foundation. So you got a birdhouse right here? Yes. Very cool. What colors you have going on here? Purple. Blue, green, yellow. Oh, nice, nice, nice. And you got the whole sun there. Oh, it's drying up. I don't, don't want to ruin it. And you can put, you can hang yourself on like on a branch next to your house. Yeah. Put some like bird food inside of here. Yes. That's cool. You gonna put any more of these on it or not? Yes. Oh, nice. oh, it sticks to it. Looks like. Okay. There you go. There you go. You put some pressure on it right there. And you got to do that on there. All right. <laughs> I got an extra birdhouse. No, I'll get caught up doing that. I won't. I'll be stuck here making birdhouses all day. <laughs> nah, that's cool. I like that. That's real nice. It's real creative. This is so cool. You did a great job. This is a grade A birdhouse. Well, insect house, I call it. Because there's no bird that fits in the <laughs> Tell him I had a motorcycle. What's your name? Vinny. Nice Vinny. to meet you. It's Vinny, Dad. I know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice to meet you again, What's up with these Apple watches, cameras, and he's the long stick? He has the shirt. He has the third. He has the third year shirt. You're the one. Like, you're the one that gave it to me last year. Yeah, yeah. Third year. Can I have your brother. jacket? Oh, uh, I give you, I give you five dollars for when it. You, when you get a Harley on, Davidson, on, you gotta buy a Harley Davidson. Who's Harley? I don't know who Harley. You gotta buy a Harley who Davidson. Who is he? <laughs> is he a friend? Yeah, he's a cool friend. Who is he? An expensive friend. How old is he? Very old. Like Very, you? Nineteen hundred. Like you? <laughs> no, I'm not we that old. Time for a commercial break. a party or special event, order I Can Candles made by participants at Grace Foundation. You can choose the color and scent. To place an order, visit our website, graceofny.org. And now, back 
to the show. I'm Jonathan, and this is my friend Zineb, Dylan, and Hunter. Hello, I'm Hunter. And today we're going to be talking about autism unscripted. Uh, you know, you were talking about uh, going to the movies this summer. You know, I heard that there's a new Garfield movie. I heard. Oh, yeah. yeah. I, you guys want to watch I that? Wanted, I wanted to see that this past uh, weekend. <laughs> nice. But but my mom's like, no, I want to see If. You can see both. It? If it's not the one with the imaginary friends, and yes, I'm yeah, telling yeah. you, the purple one looks so much like Grimace, like the McDonald's yeah. character. Yeah, it looks so yeah. much like Grimace, only with green eyes, and the hairstyle at the top is like very different. <laughs> Otherwise, it's literally him. <laughs> and I didn't know. Well, I I don't want I don't want to spoil spoil anything. Did you Did you watch it? If uh, I haven't. I personally have not, but but, but did you, you know. hear what it, what the um, the purple uh, thing uh, sounds like? No. What? Oh, what does it sound like? The, no, I I didn't want to spoil anything. All right. Because it because it I looked it up and it sounds like someone from a different show, but I don't want to spoil anything. Oh, okay. All right. I'm Open Sesame Street. I would probably know it if I remembered like a cartoon when I was little and then I hear that voice. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Yeah, Teenage Mutant uh, Ninja Turtles is a good one. 2003 is I, the best one. I don't watch that show, but I do like the theme song. Like Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Says, I like yeah. the theme song. I remember really the 2003 version. There was so much vocabulary for the little kids. It was like... So many things that like not a lot of kids say, and that's what me and my older brother always admired about the show, growing <laughs> up. And like me and my older brother were, um, we're in our twenties now. He's twenty seven. I'm twenty five. We could still sit down and watch an episode from when we were like eight and six. You know, like it, it's just that good of a show. What about the Loud House? Loud House. It's honestly, it's um. A little boring. Uh, it's it's, it's like very corny. As, as I mean, it's funny. You know, well, used to used to like watching that. Like back, like us uh, uh, since the past seven years, they love watching the yeah. Loud House How about when they were younger. My, uh, my, I think my my brother watched it once, and I saw what he was watching. I was like, "What is this?" <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Mm. My my brother goes to a special school. No. Uh, Thirty-seven. I went to a special school. Yeah, I went to a special school for, from K to twelve. But but I, I was there since third grade, and I went all the way up to twelve. So like it's the same school, but wow. different buildings and different locations. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah, that's so. cool. My brother is gonna stay <coughs> stay there until like when he's twenty-two. Oh, twenty-two. Right. Like he he's it's basically like a twelve-month program. Like nice. like Jeez. after the twenty like the twenty-six. <laughs> That's when people are usually off of school, and then he would have like a week, week and a half off, and mm. then like the beginning of July he would go back. Yeah, like my school had had the option to stay till twenty one, and that's the maximum age where you can stay. But it was mm. it was optional. Mm. So for where I yeah. went to school, but yeah, I graduated when I was seventeen, going on eighteen. Oh wow! Oh wow! That was seven years ago. I graduated. Uh, graduated June twenty third. I graduated June 2021 mm -hmm. at uh, McCown. McCown High School? Yeah. I graduated was... from Tottenville in 2018. 2018. Uh, with my best friend Brandon and my best friend Tom. And uh, our high school best friend Carlo. I graduated in 2019. 2019. Oh, well, wow. Where did you go to school? Susan Bergen High School. Right. David, Olivia, David. Natalie. Right. Yes. It's so nice to connect with other people like how you guys all went to different schools and some of you guys are together and then we all came together in one big graceful circle at Grace Foundation and we all became best friends like um like yeah. we became best friends with all of you guys you know Olivia and right. like many yeah. others around it's like it's so amazing and I know I, yeah when I graduated high school 2017 I uh, attended a program at AHRC yeah, it was it was a good program. I attended. I went to that program for 
almost five years. However, I was going to join a day hab there, but that staff member said there's like not enough room. So I came here. Plus, this is better. I used 100%. to go to that program. A thousand percent better. But this program is way better. Way better. I agree. Much 100%. more friendlier. It's beautiful yes. building. Beautiful. Yeah, and it keeps you safe. As Safety. Well, yeah. That's what I love about it. Thank you, everyone, for coming and talking about your life and things you like to do. Mm-hmm. And um, yeah, it was great talking today. And uh, it was a pleasure to be here. We'll see you next pleasure. time. See I'll you, see next you guys time. next time. We'll probably see you in the summertime. One.
Sierra Florida cat? I think so. She went into a funky time portal into the time 1980s. We gotta go. Thank you. No problem. Hee hee. Time to try that more. Hee hee. Another edition of the Grace 103.1 Forum.